The U.S. Air Force is intensifying preparations for potential large-scale combat operations, and at the heart of this readiness stands the F-22 Raptor. As the world's first operational fifth-generation fighter jet, the Raptor has long been regarded as one of the most advanced and aggressive stealth aircraft ever built. Amid mounting global tensions and the renewed emphasis on near-peer conflict, the F-22 is being honed for missions that go far beyond routine patrols or limited engagements. The Raptor was conceived in the late Cold War era as the ultimate air dominance platform designed to ensure American superiority against any adversary. Its unique combination of stealth, supersonic speed, and extreme maneuverability has made it a benchmark for modern fighter jets. However, the jet has never been used in large-scale air warfare. Most of its operational history has involved deterrence missions, presence operations, and limited combat sorties in the Middle East. The current shift signals a change in how the U.S. intends to deploy its most elite air asset. One of the key drivers behind these preparations is the strategic challenge posed by advanced adversaries such as China and Russia. Both nations have developed sophisticated air defense systems, long-range missiles, and modern fighter aircraft designed to erode U.S. advantages in the skies. For this reason, the F-22 is being positioned not merely as a defensive tool, but as the spearhead of offensive air campaigns. With its ability to penetrate deep into contested airspace and destroy high-value targets before being detected, the Raptor is seen as indispensable in any scenario involving large-scale combat. To maximize its potential, the Air Force is investing in upgrades to the Raptor's avionics, sensors, and weapons systems. While the jet's airframe remains unparalleled, new software and hardware enhancements are being integrated to improve its situational awareness, electronic warfare capabilities, and network connectivity. The F-22 of today is far more than a stealthy dogfighter. It is evolving into a battle manager that can gather, process, and relay data across the battlefield. This makes it an essential component of the Pentagon's vision for joint all-domain operations, where air, land, sea, space, and cyber forces are seamlessly connected. Another focus is pilot readiness. Training exercises are being scaled up to simulate high-intensity warfare against technologically advanced enemies. These drills include large formations, complex electronic threats, and scenarios where the F-22 must coordinate with F-35, bomber, and allied aircraft. Such exercises not only refine tactics, but also build the interoperability needed for multinational operations. The Raptor is rarely deployed alone. It is intended to work in tandem with other assets, striking the most dangerous targets while enabling allied forces to operate more freely. Logistics also play a vital role. The F-22 fleet is relatively small, with fewer than 190 aircraft available. Maintaining them at peak readiness requires a dedicated effort in spare parts, 
specialized maintenance crews, and rapid deployment infrastructure. The Air Force has been working to streamline sustainment processes, ensuring that the Raptors can be dispersed, hidden, and launched quickly from multiple bases if a crisis erupts. Critics have often pointed to the high cost of the F-22 program, which ultimately led to its production line being halted in 2012. Yet, in today's strategic environment, the aircraft's value is increasingly evident. No other platform can match its blend of stealth and aerial dominance, and adversaries are well aware of the psychological effect its deployment has. The presence of Raptors in a theater is not just a tactical asset, it is a strategic signal of American resolve. Looking ahead, the Raptors' role will likely expand as part of the Air Force's layered approach to air dominance. The aircraft will operate alongside next-generation systems such as loyal wingman drones and eventually the next-generation air dominance fighter. Until those future systems are fielded, however, the F-22 remains the cutting edge of American air power. Preparing it for large-scale combat is both a necessity and a reminder of the enduring importance of air superiority in modern warfare. As geopolitical competition sharpens, the F-22 Raptor stands ready not just as a weapon of war, but as a symbol of deterrence. Its preparation for high-intensity combat underscores a sobering reality. The United States is actively planning for scenarios where control of the skies may once again determine the outcome of global conflict. In such a contest, the Raptor will be expected to do what it was built for, achieve dominance, overwhelm opponents, and ensure that American and allied forces can operate without fear of hostile air power.